Uh, hi, my name is Kelsey and I'm a career coach with National Able Network. My job search advice is how to answer the question, what is your biggest weakness? Which is going to come up in every interview you're ever going to have. Um, you really want to start by thinking about what is it the employer wants? What are they looking for and what is it that's going to be very important in helping them make the decision that you're the best candidate for the job? You have to start thinking about what's going to happen in the job. What is going to be a weakness that's going to actually impact them? If you're applying for a security guard position and you feel like your biggest weakness is that you're not a great typist, that's not really relevant and the employer doesn't really need to hear about it. You never want to waste the employer's time by giving them information they don't need. You always want to show them that you respect them. So what you want to do is think about a weakness that impacts the job. If I'm applying for a secretarial job, not being a fast typist is a great answer to have. You want to let them know that's your weakness, let them know you understand how it impacts the job. So I'm not a fast typist. Maybe it means sometimes I don't get things done as quickly as I'd like to. But then the place where you really make the answer count is when you tell them what you're doing about it. What are you doing to make yourself better in this position already? I'm not the fastest typist out there, so what I do is I make sure every night when I go home, I practice typing half an hour to an hour at least. I play those little games online. I will copy pages out of the newspaper. I'll do whatever it is. Something that shows the employer that you understand where this is a weakness and that you understand how to make it better, that you're actually putting this effort in. Before they're even paying you, you're already becoming a better employee for them. That's how you really want to show them that you're not just going to do the work that they need you to do, but you're the kind of person that they want to work with. You're someone who can take criticism, who can implement it, and who's going to be able to become really the employee that they can keep with them for a long time.